Tonight at 6, the largest investment in green energy manufacturing in the history of the U.S. is coming to Georgia. Georgia can count 2,500 new jobs in the clean energy sector. This is a result of Senator Ossoff's Solar Energy Manufacturing for America Act becoming law. A big win for Georgia farmers following India's 70% tax cut on U.S. pecan exports. Georgia Senator John Ossoff has been working with U.S. trade negotiators and the Indian government to make this happen. The US U.S. Senate passed new legislation to expand capacity at the Port of Brunswick with the goal of reducing supply chain bottlenecks. This was all a part of Senator John Ossoff's Navigation Channel Improvement Act. John Ossoff said today is an historic day for Georgia's economy. The Peach State will see millions of dollars to expand broadband internet access. Georgia Senator John Ossoff's push to begin a high-speed rail system from Atlanta to Savannah passed Thursday evening in the Senate. Georgia Senator John Ossoff secured bipartisan support to help build Wilkinson County's first public sewer system. There are new efforts to protect, preserve, and restore the Chattahoochee River. A bill from Georgia U.S. Senator John Ossoff is now law. The Chattahoochee River Act will help improve water quality and restore ecosystems along the river. And Senator John Ossoff's bipartisan bill to prevent and treat opioid addiction is now officially law. A bill Senator Ossoff introduced that will fund law enforcement and mental health services on its way to President Biden's desk to be signed into law. I've been able to bring Democrats and Republicans together to fund law enforcement and mental health programs. A new bill could make insulin more affordable. Ossoff calls it a victory for seniors across the state. A $35 per month cap guaranteed through Medicare for insulin for America's seniors. Georgia Senator John Ossoff secured new resources to offer mobile health clinic options to families across Southwest Georgia. Senator John Ossoff is continuing his pledge to help mothers this time with a baby supply bank. A bill to protect your children from online predators just passed in the U.S. Senate. It's a bipartisan bill by Democratic Georgia Senator John Ossoff. Zero tolerance for sex offenders who target children. U.S. Senator John Ossoff is continuing to push legislation that's aimed at helping military personnel and their families. I have fought for and secured the most significant pay raise for military service members in more than two decades. When it comes to the military, Ossoff is working across the aisle to address issues with barracks and child care. A U.S. Senator John Ossoff came up with the Military Housing Affordability Act of 2022. John Ossoff's bipartisan bill to help Georgia's veterans access their service benefits passed the U.S. Senate. Earlier today, the president signed into law the PACT Act, protecting the health of U.S. veterans. The new law will guarantee health benefits for vets exposed to burn pits and other toxic chemicals. The bipartisan legislation was championed by U.S. Senator John Ossoff. Caring for them when they return, it's not a favor. It's our job. Also tonight, a major military housing contractor under fire on Capitol Hill after an eight-month-long Senate investigation found mismanagement put the health and safety of American military families at risk. Senator John Ossoff shared the review. Today, you led a, a hearing on the inhumane conditions at Atlanta's federal penitentiary. An investigation into prison deaths has lawmakers calling for more transparency and accountability. A major victory for Georgia Senator John Ossoff as President Biden signs one of his prison reform bills into law in an effort to cut corruption, misconduct, and abuse in U.S. prisons. I will continue to pursue the truth as I said I would as a candidate, as I am now as a senator.